Hello everyone, I'm going to be showing you how to get started with the latest 2013 version of Prezi. After you've signed up and created your account, you'll see a blue button at the top of the screen that says New Prezi. After you click that button, Prezi will ask you to choose a template. There are a lot of different templates, but if you don't like any of them, you can choose to use a blank one. On the left hand side of the screen, you'll see the sequence of your different slides. In Prezi, we call these frames. You can navigate between the frames by clicking on them or by using the arrow keys. To start editing the template, click on the text. Once you click on the text, a widget appears which allows you to edit what you just typed. You can choose preset styles, title, subtitle, or body, and you also have other basic text editing functions. You can change the theme at any point by going to the top of the screen and clicking the themes option. This changes the color scheme and the fonts for the entire presentation. To start editing a different frame, you can select the frame on the left side of the screen or double click the frame from the full screen view. You can resize your text by expanding the text box or by using the plus or minus buttons. You can create a new text box simply by clicking on the blank part of the screen where you want your text to be. The cool thing about Prezi is that you can make a frame within a frame. So if you want to expand on information in a frame, you can make a new frame for it. To draw your new frame, select the Frame and Arrows button at the top of the screen and select one of the options. I'm going to draw a bracket frame under the sliced bread text and you will see the new frame is added to the sequence on the left. And if I double click on that box, I will zoom in and I can start adding information to the new frame. You can repeat this process and add numerous different frames within the same frame. Instead of adding text to a slide, you can also add images. You can do this by selecting the insert button at the top of the screen and selecting image. A new section will appear at the right side of the screen where you can upload an image or search Google Images right there and select a photo from there. Double click the image and it will start processing and show up in your frame. You can also add a YouTube video as content on your frame. To do this, go back to the insert icon at the top of the page and select YouTube video. Paste the URL to the video in the pop-up box and the video is inserted right onto the frame. The last feature I'm going to show you is the diagram feature. If you want to represent information within a frame as some sort of process, you can insert a diagram to better convey the information. From the insert icon, select diagram. Based on the process you want to represent, select one of the templates. Each section of the diagram is a frame, which are automatically added to the left side panel. Click on the frames on the left, and you can edit each individual part of the diagram. Once you finish your presentation, don't forget to hit the save button in the top left corner. Prezi automatically saves your presentation every five minutes. Then you can hit the share button, which lets you export your presentation to a few different mediums. So this has been a basic rundown of the core Prezi features, and I hope this helps you get started. Thanks for watching.